<clears throat> okay, so we get in the mouth. Okay, we're gonna get a gift wrap. First things first, I'm gonna grab both wrists, right? Then, in order to pin, I wanna get one wrist pinned. In order to do it, all I have to do is start moving his arms around in different directions, very violently, and then pin one, because he can't cut that compensate for all that motion. It looks like this. And then I pin, right? Now from there, I go under his head. I make sure I go under the crown of his head, it's not his neck, and I go all the way to my elbow, it's under his head. That way, the ground is holding his head up, not my arm strength, right? Now from here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna transfer his hand that I have to my other hand, I'm gonna grip it, no thumbs, like a Kimura grip. This really scares people, and it's starting to bring his hand through. And once I see this hand, just breathe quick. Once I see this hand coming, what I need to do, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna have my thumb inside pulling, I'm gonna have my thumb to the outside so I can push his hand through, right? I'm gonna push his hand through, then with thumb, I'm gonna grab that gift wrap position. Now, I'm gonna get up to my side and bring him to this technical mount. Now, the first choke we're gonna do, I'm gonna take my hand inside, bring it along, right along his neck, like an Ezekiel kinda, right? Now from here, I'm gonna dip my shoulder down as deep as I can so I can get all the way up to this tricep. Once I grab this tricep, I squeeze, tap right there, right? So again, the motion is, with my free arm, under and into his neck. Don't go to the back of his neck. Make sure on the front or the side of his neck, right? Now, I'm gonna bring my shoulder down so my arm can go deeper to the tricep. Then I'm gonna squeeze. Tap. What was that? Okay, now, the second one, I'm going for it and his hand comes in and try to save him. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna grab his wrist. I'm gonna grab his wrist, right, with my free arm. And I'm gonna grab from in between his arms, right? If you grab it up, that's fine. If you grab it down, that's fine too. Okay, now from here, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get my chest behind his back, I'm gonna start rolling him out. And as I roll him out, I'm gonna get my, my uh, first hand, that first gift wrap grip hand, I'm gonna get that one free. And I'm gonna roll him to his belly. Now he's, he's crushed, he can't go anywhere. I'm gonna use my free arm, go under the jaw, under the jaw, get my grip and squeeze. Tap. Gift wrap attacks, let's get it.